Hello everyone, welcome back to the Football Project YouTube channel. Today I'm back with another video uh, as Manchester City have beaten Arsenal 2-1 at the Emirates. But before we get into that, I want to wish everyone a happy new year. Hope this year brings uh, nothing but good things to you and your family. Uh, and hope you have a, had, a good, uh, had a good one last night. And uh, I'm hoping for a healthy year for everyone. And let's hope it's better than the last one. Uh, so... Manchester City against Arsenal, incredible game of football, incredible game of football. Arsenal really surprised me here today. First half, they were absolutely dominant. Um, they outplayed Manchester City, which, which is something that not a lot of sides can say this season. Because Manchester City have been incredible. They've won 10 games in a row before this game. And um, Arsenal have been in a bit of good form as well. They've won like four, four of the last five games. And um, they they were really great in the first half. They were very, very good. And uh, they got their goal through Bukayo Saka. Uh, great work uh, by the whole Arsenal side. That goal, great finish by Bukayo Saka. They've had a few chances as well with uh, Martinelli. Had a good shot in the first half as well. And City didn't really do anything the first half. They didn't, have, they didn't even have a shot on target. Uh, Gabriel Jesus was very, very disappointing. Same with uh, Kevin De Bruyne. Both of them went went on the top. Uh, they didn't really play great, in my opinion, today. Um, but second half is where all the all the stuff happened. Uh, in my opinion, Arsenal really threw away a win here today. They really threw away a win with very poor decision making and some very poor mistakes by individuals. Uh, first of all, it all started in the 55th minute. Xhaka clearly brought down uh, Bernardo Silva for a penalty. Clear penalty. Very, very dumb challenge from uh, Granit Xhaka. He, he not only did he pull uh, Bernardo Silva back, but he also stuck a leg out and brought him down with a leg as well. Clear penalty. I don't know why there's been so much complaining about uh, the refereeing today. Uh that was a clear penalty in my opinion. I'd, I'd love to hear if you have a different view on it, but that's a clear, as clear as penalty as they get. Bad mistake by Xhaka. After that, Arsenal uh, go straight away into the attack right after the kickoff, and uh, a big mistake by Laporte heads it into his own net, but Nathan Ake clears it off the line. It comes out to Gabriel Martinelli, and Martinelli misses uh, an open net. Uh, he hits the bar and uh, Arsenal miss a chance to get the lead again. And right after that, Gabriel, G uh, Gabriel Magalhaes with a, with a very dumb challenge. Like, he got, he got a yellow card for something he did in the penalty. I, I don't really know what he did. I think he just he was scuffing the penalty spot, was complaining about the penalty or something like that. And he got a yellow card there. And uh, two minutes later, he just... Brings down Gabriel Gabriel Jesus for no reason at all. He gets sent off, and that's basically game over. And it's very disappointing if you're an Arsenal fan because three mistakes have cost you a win today. Because Manchester City, there's no way they were winning this game tonight. Uh, if it weren't for all those things that happened, they were awful. Uh, probably their worst performance of the season, and they still get away with a win. Um, with uh, Rodri in the ninety third in the ninety third minute. Uh, Arsenal just slept a bit defensively uh, and uh, Rodri won it for City in the end uh, but it's a very big missed opportunity for Arsenal to get more of a hold of the top four position because now they are going to be looking back to West Ham United and Spurs who have l less games than them and they might uh, and they might be ahead of them when those games are played uh, and it was a huge missed opportunity very very m big miss missed opportunity uh, there's been a lot of complaining, as I said, about the refereeing decisions. Um, I mean, you could argue Arsenal maybe could have had a penalty in the first half, but I do think Edison did get the ball first. I'm not 100% on that. On first look, I thought it was a penalty as well, but through all the replays, I think Edison did get the ball first and then got the man, so I don't think uh, that was a penalty. But big mistake from Granit Xhaka giving away a dumb penalty. Uh, even bigger mistake from Gabriel Magalhaes getting sent off for for no reason at all. Uh, just lost his header, and uh, Gabriel Martinelli, who overall had a good game, but 
you cannot be missing uh, open goals against uh, this Manchester City side. And it's mistakes that, are, that have cost uh, Arsenal the game here today. Uh, so guys, what do you guys think of this game? The first game of 2022. I hope you guys have a great year. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, don't forget to drop the video a like. And also subscribe to the channel if you are new. Uh, I will see you guys on the next one. Goodbye.